Alright, here we are with, uh, episode 4, I think, of Let's Play Robo Warrior. We're at the end of period 3-1. We've got a decent amount of items at the moment. We're gonna be using a lot of candles here soon, which is kind of annoying. Hoping to get more missiles, hoping to get more of these. So, let's end this level here. And we've got a bit of, uh, different content here for once. Got this barren area instead of the usual block-filled stuff. So for this level, we're gonna use a boot. Try to move through most of it fast. Go right in here. Still need as many items as I can possibly get. Some specific items I'm looking for more than others. Missiles being one of them. Money being another. Points are good. There's some money. There's some money. I'm going to start buying items soon from the shop. So, why did I do that? I don't even know anymore. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to start buying items soon from the shop, so... I need dollars to buy them with. back down we go. going to be a lot of dungeon diving in this episode, I think. Alright. Money, money, money. More money. Want more. Now, why don't we just do that? Move on through some of the rest of this a little easier. Another boot I don't need. Ow. Ooh, more money. Money is good. Ooh, a whole pile of stuff up there. Alright. Out of there we go. Ow. Dang it. You know, I hate you so much. Why do you suck? Gives you all those missiles anyway. And right back down we go. Alright. Avoid that. Run out of candle almost immediately. Grab that. No. It'll turn into another stupid ghosty thing. Oh man. Few too many of these dungeons in this level. I mean, jeez. I keep forgetting what height level I entered at. It's gonna make it difficult to get out at times. Ow! Jackass! <laughs> Ow! Missiles are good. Aha! The exit! Alright, now we gotta cross this river here. Hey. Now there's a secret hidden here. The Room of Idols is, uh, somewhere you wouldn't really expect it to be. It took me a little while to figure out where it was in this level. Let me get those guys out of the way. And... And we're gonna run up here. I should have used that beforehand. Oh well. It's not that big of a deal. There, move faster. Get those guys out of my way. I hate wasting flashes like that, but. I needed to get out of the water. Oh boy, here's the pillars. But first, back into the darkness. 
Oh, more candles that I don't want to use. But I need items. I need them. You know, this place is awfully green. We could really use with a change of color palette here. Which I think we are actually going to get in the next level or so. So that's nice. I'm tired of this place. It's annoying. Ow. Ha, ah, you missed that time. You who missed. Ah, you all missed. Because you suck. Alright. Now, this is a spot where I can get some major items here. If this one bird would stop coming out of there. Okay. Go like so. And then... We're finally gonna use one of these things. The Megaton Bomb. Oh, I just love doing that. That is so satisfying. What was that? Well, that was a noise I didn't expect. No, seriously, what was that? I've never heard that sound before. The heck? What happened? What? Was that a glitch or what? I thought something freaky was gonna jump out at me or something. Anyway, yes, there's only a few specific spots in the game where it's a good idea to do that to get items, and that was one of them. Now, I could use another one here. I'm not going to. One is enough for now. So now we gotta get the key. There is a boss to be fought. So we're going to try to get in there, take care of him quick. There's the key. Let's fire off a missile or two, see if I can get some more items. Aha, that's right, there's one of these here too. I want that candle. It's gonna disappear if I go in the thing first. Get out of my way, triangle. Stupid geometry. Okay, let's... It's just crashing everything. Like that, yeah. Something like that. I hate you so much. Go away. Boy, thank you. I hate those blob things. I know I keep saying that, but it's like I can't emphasize it enough. Aha! Uh -huh. Let's see here. Where is. Ooh, money. There we go. All right. Uh, yeah, I'll fire off another couple of missiles, see if I can get some more items. Well, that was a waste. Or was it? Ooh, candle! I like candles. And these boots are common, too. There's really no reason why I shouldn't be using them pretty much all the time. They seem to be almost the most common item in the game. Alright. Ooh, another one. Well, let's fire it. Stupid triangles! Oh, that's right, explode! Alright, now it's boss time. Finally, a boss. This is the first boss out of seven, I think? I could be wrong on that one. I'm pretty sure it's seven, though. This guy's not too tough. We're gonna get rid of him with a minimum amount of fuss here. 
Not gonna use any missiles or bombs on him. Or flashers. He takes a lot of hits though. I just don't want to run into him. Does a good bit of damage if I do. Crossfire makes it easier to deal with him. So I don't have to worry about stopping the aim. I can just move around and avoid him and his attacks. And you know what's not making this easy? Is my hair getting in my eyes while I'm trying to do this. I should have turned my fan off. Really should have done that. Ah, oh, just die. I mean, jeez. There we go. Exploded him. All right, that was the first boss. Not really too tough. The second one will be a lot worse. Now we're going to buy items. Gonna buy a lamp. Gonna buy a lamp. Actually, that'll do. Just want two lamps. All right, and I think this is a good stopping point for now. So this has been Let's Play Robo Warrior episode number four. We ran through a million dungeons and killed a boss this time. Bought a couple of items. Um, next level, it's back to more block breaking. There are a couple more interesting levels coming up, though, soon, right after that, so we'll see how that goes. For now, thanks for watching. Hope to see you again next time. And I gotta close this again. Yay!